Greetings, Soulswind here, and welcome to Let's Play Minecraft Windows 10 Bedrock Edition Survival Single Player. Hi, hi. Um, I think I finally realized why my scroller is missing the left right scroller. I think it's because um, my window is a little too um, long vertically, so it doesn't work. But anyway, welcome to the stream, Asymmetrical. Asim said good evening at about 8.47 when I was just setting up the stream for for later. <laughs> so, um, yeah, sorry about that. Now, the thing is, today, we're going to continue with the tunnel. I don't know if we'll finally complete the tunnel. But, um, now, there's a problem that I'm facing because we have some... Um, family commitments and family uh, related matters so I hope I won't be streaming too long today just because there's a need to reduce like noise and volume towards the later part of the night in order to facilitate um, better and more restful night and sleep for my family so um, yeah you know like streams I, I tend to overreact sometimes okay sometimes right <clears throat> so there is a possibility that I will I, I will be loud and I wanna like avoid that possibility and therefore I'm just thinking I may have to reduce the duration of the stream um, okay, actually, it's just me here for now, so I'll wait till someone comes by and then explain that. Um, I think Asim is just stepping away for a moment. Sorry, I, I just drank a lot of water, so like a little burpy again. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so maybe I'll just wait for Asim to arrive before I repeat myself again. <laughs> well, anyways, for now, yeah, I don't think I'm bringing those with me. Let's see. Okay, one of the efficient ways to send things would be to use like mine cards and then just send them over. Hey, Andrew Gaming, hi, welcome to the stream. Um, it's a Saturday for you, isn't it, Andrew? Andrew, Andrew, Andrew's from. Andrew's from. Oh, Andrew, you haven't told me which country you're from. So, Andrew, where are you from? Which country are you from? Um, how's your day? I think it's a Saturday regardless, right? Because even in New Zealand, it will still be late Saturday, but it will still be Saturday. So, I suppose it will be Saturday. Oh, Indonesian! Hi! Did I mention where I'm from, though? Um, we are almost neighbors, I would say, almost. Andri from Indonesia. Oh, that's nice. Andrew Gaming from Indonesia. Let me just write that down. Okay. Ta da! Yeah. Um, we're almost neighbors. Um, I'm from Singapore, so nice to meet you. I. Unfortunately, I don't really know Bahasa Indonesia. So, yeah, I don't think I can greet you in Bahasa Indonesia. <laughs> but yes, welcome. Welcome to the stream. I hope you. I hope you had a good Saturday then. Because in Indonesia, it's probably Saturday night, right? So I hope you had a good Saturday. And um, welcome, welcome. How was your dinner? Hope it was good. Um, yeah, I think uh, today we're just going to continue with the tunnel <laughs> as usual, right? <laughs> Yeah, we're just we're just gonna continue with the tunnel and then hopefully because we're really really close to the sand biome the desert biome I'm just praying hard that today will be the last day building the tunnel Where are you from? I'm from Singapore Nice to meet you So we are almost neighbors Andre. We're almost neighbors almost Almost. Yeah. I'm from Singapore. So nice to meet you. 
Indonesia, ooh, nice. Are you from Jakarta? Perhaps, could you be from Jakarta? Or somewhere else? <gasps> Oops, I think I want to keep this here though, because I want to try and like, bring more things with me, so yeah, oopsie. Um, we'll see. For now, let's just do that. And do that. Okay. Oh. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Don't have enough. Never mind. <laughs> let's go from here. Oh, Singapore. Yep, Singapore. I'm from Singapore. So, nice to meet you. Um, I... I don't know how to say greetings, though. Salamat something. <laughs> I I cannot remember what is the right greeting. I think it's Salamat something, if I'm not mistaken. But yeah. Anyways, welcome, welcome. How was your dinner? What did you have for dinner? What did you have for dinner? Hope it was good dinner. Mm, okay, we're gonna keep this here for now. This one here for now. Uh, charcoal here, yeah, together with the rest of those things, and uh, furnace, 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 probably here, and then here. How was your lunch the other day? Hope it was good. Hey, asymmetrical, welcome to the stream once again. Good evening to you. Um, yeah, I bought, uh, wait, hang on, what did I buy that day? Oh, I bought, um, choose food rice. Basically, it's, uh, like, economy rice, so it's, like, I picked, like, um, two, okay, the rice was, like, um, hot dogs with potatoes or hot dogs with french fries in sweet sauce, so basically they, they, they had this sweet and sour sauce. And then that was one of the dish. Another dish was, uh, let me think. Another dish was uh, chicken, basically um, salted egg fried chicken. Minute, no, not really minute rice, but rather it's like I go to a stall to buy the rice. Like um, basically it's at a stall. So I go to the stall to buy the rice and then uh, you get to choose, like, there's a lot of dishes, about 40 different choices available for you to choose. So you pick one out of, like, the 40 or 50, I think 40, about 40 different dishes available. You pick um, a number of them. So, like, um, meat is usually, like, tap. Tap, like? Oh, <laughs> thanks for the like. Um, yeah, so basically... Rice oroni? No, not really rice oroni. So it's like you you have like a box of rice. So they'll 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 say okay, I want to take away. So they'll have a bowl of rice in the packet, and then with the rice, then they say okay. So what do you want to pick? What are the dishes you want to pick? And then you pick your dishes. So like for example, I picked the first dish was the um, French fries with hot dog in sweet and sour sauce. Then I picked uh, the salted egg chicken, and then I picked. Um, um, not really cabbage. It's some Chinese um, vegetable, I think. It's called, uh, I think it's called Xiao Bai Cai. Small, white vegetable. <laughs> Direct translation. Basically, it's it's not cabbage. That's all. Some some leafy green, basically. Yeah, some leafy green. Um, and then I picked uh, omelette. Yeah. So four different dishes. Two vegetables, including, including the omelette, is considered... A vegetable dish and uh, two um, like meat dishes so the meat will be one dollar each and the vegetables will be about 60 70 cents there about so in total it was around four dollars yeah in, in total that was about four dollars and I managed to find my charcoal tiao photo just Today, just a while ago, like an hour ago, I realized that, oh, I haven't sent it to you. And it took me a while to search for it, but I managed to find it. So, I think and I hope I will be able to send it to you. 
Um, but yeah, I I managed to find it, so I should be able to share with you the photo of um, the char kway teow that I cooked. Uh, you mean the you mean the economy rice, the one that I bought for lunch, the economy rice. Did I have leftover? Or do you mean the char kway teow? Obviously the char kway teow was from last year, so I wouldn't have any. Um, but if you mean the economy rice, no. It's it's one person share. It's usually one person share. It's just enough for one person. Like, most people only order one meat and two vegetable dishes. Like, potato, tofu, egg, and um, vegetables. They are considered vegetable dishes. Anything on this, like let's say if there's any minced meat on the potato or on the tofu, it becomes a meat dish. So, you know, I had like french fries with hot dogs, it's considered a meat dish, not a vegetable dish. So that's how they, they um, categorize. Once you have any form of meat on it, it becomes a meat dish. So that's that. So that one is usually one person, one serving. So there's almost no reason for any leftovers to be there. So if I feel I'm not too hungry, I'll not go for four dishes. I'll go for three. Um, how big was the dish? Do you have something for size comparison? Yes, let me try to find an image to share with you. Let me at least keep keep this lava buckets because I'm gonna like um alt tab or something use my second screen and don't, don't want to accidentally click something wrong there so for safety purposes i'm going to keep the lava first okay uh let's see images uh -huh. Do you know the styrofoam packets? Styrofoam takeaways? Uh, okay, you know the size of a styrofoam box, right? So, g giving you this picture would help. This is all meat dish though. But um, I think sharing this might help. Oh my god, this is a huge link right there. Ta-da! Oops, can I share that? <gasps> can I share that? No, the link is too big. Oh my god, how do I share this? How do I share this? The link is too big. Can I can I open an incognito? The page you're trying to access is sending you away. Um I wanna share something not so big. Styrofoam box are uh, illegal in NY now. Okay, oh, I see. I see. Uh, yeah, basically, basically, I have no choice because um, of my laziness. <laughs> I should bring my own, um, like, plastic containers to, to take away. I think this is better. Um, you have to scroll down to the styrofoam box, not the first one, obviously. Yeah, not the first one. It's a styrofoam box. So, yeah, just scroll down to the styrofoam box. Instead of the first one, it's not that one. It, it's, a, it's a second picture. Um, yeah. From the link that I just shared, the second picture, the one with the styrofoam box. So that's that's the amount. But in this in this one I don't know what's the white um lump in the middle though. This person seems to have extra rice plus um two types of vegetables and one meat. So anyway, yeah, so that's how it looks like, basically. That's how it looks like.
Yep, so, um, the thing is that, okay, this is what it looks like after you buy the food. Let me find a picture for you, the common sight that you'll see at the stall. To know, like, how, how attractive buying this economy rice actually is. Alright, so... Let's uh, find an image. Okay. Not a good picture. Not a very good representation. This would be a good representation. Yes. Okay, so, um, you can take a look, just scroll down through this entire page. You see the different stalls, you see how much options were given, and you choose a few, like three or four, out of these options available from this link. And you see how it looks like from a customer's perspective when you actually arrive at the stall, and you know that the meat is only going to cost you about $1 if you order one serving but if you order two serving then obviously there's going to be more fish usually costs about two dollars if you're ordering like a chicken wing or something it could cost more like the chicken wing itself could be two dollars chicken thighs itself could be four dollars or three depending on on like the size of the chicken thigh the thigh not thigh chicken thigh and things like that so yeah so that's the uh that's the variation or the difference there so depending on the cook depending on the chef they may have different styles of cooking and whatnot so um sometimes like uh because like um this is more of a i don't know how to call that but basically like different different chefs would have different cooking styles so you may not find the same food everywhere you know, like, your favorite food may be, like, sweet and sour pork, but, um, okay, sweet and sour pork is a very, very, very common dish. Like, a lot of people love it. So, you would find that more common than many other options available out there. So, most of the time, if you arrive at a stall, you should safely be able to order this dish, the sweet and sour pork. It can be chicken. Some people use chicken to cook it, sweet and sour chicken, but generally sweet and sour meat dice, pork or chicken. Fish will be too expensive. If you have sweet and sour fish, it would go into $2 instead of one. So yeah. But generally you'll be spoiled for choice. You'll be spoiled for choice. You see how many options there are? It's absolutely amazing. Like, especially especially when it's, like, lunchtime. Yeah, that's the best time to buy. Don't go later because, like, when you go too late and then, like, you know, half the options are gone. Um, yeah, that we only have ourselves to blame for going past lunchtime when all the food options that are really delicious have been ordered. Uh, we, we can only blame ourselves for that, right? <laughs> so... Try to go slightly before lunch if you want the dishes to be hot. Because if you see from the images, um, some of them actually, like, you know, as, especially, like, the top layers and whatnot, actually, like, some of these things, um, they don't have fire below to keep the food heated. That means it can turn cold. It can turn cold. Bourbon chicken. Bourbon chicken is a little bit like teriyaki, more on the sour, uh, no, more on the salty side, like savory, but more on the salty side, I believe. Um, they have a lot of options. I don't know what exactly is bourbon chicken because, you know, like most of the time, you just point and that one, uh, that one, and this one, you know. You don't even need to know the names. You don't even need to say, hey, I want this, this chicken, or, or um, you say out the dish name or something only the sweet and sour pork there is a special name here you know we'll we'll just say it out to that one but most of the other dishes you just point this 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 and this 
Or you can say like, you know, you point at the meat dish and say $2. They will know that you want two servings of that. Or if, if it's not $2 for two serving, they'll let you know. They'll just tell you, oh, two servings, that's 220 Then you can decide whether you still want to proceed or not. Uh, you don't really like fish? I think you mentioned before, I know for sure you don't, you don't take tomatoes. I think you have some sort of allergy or something. But fish, I sort of have this recollection. Like, it's not totally unfamiliar to the point where I say, wow, really? No, it seems to be something you've mentioned before about the fish, but it's just a vague recollection. Very vague recollection. So, uh, yeah. Oops. I told you about the Thai food trailer in my hometown, didn't I? Uh, mm. <laughs> Goldfish wind. What do you expect? <laughs> But honestly, though, it's, it's, I don't think I really recall this. I mean, like, for example, the fish I sort of vaguely recall, but the, but the Thai food trailer really, no. I don't seem to recall anything about that. Did you mention that before? I know the fish, maybe, because, like, it's not foreign. Like I said, it's not really foreign. It seems like something was there. So I could recognize that. But... The other one, the Thai food trailer. Mm, I don't think so. Oops, where's my... Ah, here it is. So we're just transferring everything towards the front. For convenience. For convenience. I think we can just go ahead. We can follow the other side for the torches, so it's not a big deal. Okay, let's continue. Oops. So anyway, yes, um, that's that's what we usually order for, like you know, food on a daily basis. Like when you when you go out for food, usually that's what you order. Uh, at, at least for like um, in the neighborhood like if you want to go for a cheap food it's uh, it's usually that it's usually economy rice in Indonesia night in Singapore morning um, Andre in Singapore it's nighttime as well we're almost neighbors right Asia in Asia Singapore's Asian country too unless um, Andre uh, yeah no, not not unless. What am I saying, Andrew? I'm in Asia also. Singapore is an Asian country. It is nighttime here. It's uh, nine twenty-five p.m. and I believe we might even have the same timing. We we might even share the same time zone. It is nighttime right here. Yeah. So I'm. I'm also in the night here right now. It's night time. Wow. I ran out of iron. Really. With so much iron, I ran out of iron? Are you kidding me? Oh, and also I need... um. Redstone torches. Do I have redstone torches? Yes, I do have some here. That's good. So let's put them around here. Do, 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 do. So yeah, Isim, I don't recall anything about the Thai food trailer. Okay, anyway, here we also have got like Western food, like for example, pork chops, um, chicken chop, um, like, you know, like for example, chicken cutlet and all that stuff. Do you eat beef though? I suppose you do eat beef, right?
Okay, it was a small trailer and they opened for lunch every weekday and stayed open until they were out of food or wanted to close. Okay, cool, cool. So that's the operating hours. And there's always an end when we're talking about this. So one day, my wife and I went there at 12.30 p.m., which is lunchtime. So which is generally the middle or end of the lunch rush. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. I think I see where you're going with this, with this buildup. I think I might be able to guess where you're going with that. But, mm-hmm. My guess is that they actually ran out of food. Even though it is like lunchtime. My guess is that they ran out of food at lunchtime. At the peak of lunch. Like 12.30 is like the peak of lunch here. Because lunchtime is from 12 to 1. So actually like some some offices they have like staggered lunchtime. So let's say, um, you know, when they go for like lunch, some people actually are seen leaving office at 1 p.m. Not 12 p.m., but 1 p.m. So their lunch goes from 1 to 2 o'clock. And depending on the distant, the distance to the nearest food source or like food court or something, there can be places where it's actually longer to walk out because of um, like industrial areas and whatnot. So depending, they could be given like 10, 20 minutes more to walk back. So that really depends. Yeah, we're running out of iron. We have to go retrieve more iron from our base. So probably go back to the base, get some more iron, and we'll see. Uh, Andrew says 8.27 p.m. Ah, interesting. So we are one hour ahead of you. We're 9.29 now we're at 929 right now so we're an hour ahead of you pretty interesting I would say it's it's an hour difference I thought it would have been the same time zone looks like I'm mistaken too anyways let's go back and get more iron we know we need them uh, so we walked up to them. They had a menu, but no prices listed. I asked them what's the cost. They said, how much do you want to spend? I told them $10 per person. Wait, 10 That? That's in USD. And that means it's local currency 13 What? Okay, okay, let's see how much you get. I would expect you to get an equal equivalent of like eight persons share I mean you and your wife I think you'll probably get eight persons serving of food because it's not it's not like a restaurant you know it's not like a restaurant food will be more expensive it's not like a cafe so I would say maybe six person because like a trailer they do have to maintain their trailer and whatnot maybe six and it's more like it's not like um economy rice is there for a reason they they make um they take advantage of the economies of scale and they bulk purchase their food items so like they cook it one time and it can serve like maybe 50 to 100 servings therefore economies of scale that's fine so maybe for the food trailer i would say 10 dollars per person in usc that's 13 would for probably at least fetch you about two and a half servings. Completed the end. Roger Sid, it's been so long. Welcome to the stream. Hi. Completed the end? I thought you were here though. I I defeated the end dragon. Were you not here? Have you been away for that long though? <laughs> I don't think so. Um I've, I've completed the end. Basically, I've uh, challenged the end dragon, and that's why I have these end rods. They use chorus fruit from the end. These are from the end. The chorus fruit's from the end. So, 
Um, yeah. Uh, they said ten dollars. They proceeded to give me the rest of the food in their cart. We got fifteen spring rolls, five quarts of pad thai, six quarts of hot and sour soup, and a bunch of other food for ten dollars. They wanted to close. Even if they didn't want to close, I believe it will still be almost as much. I mean, okay, let's say, let's say when you go to like you know the economy rice stall, when they're about to close. They will give you slightly more rice and more um, dishes, but your options are way more limited than you would have been accorded had you gone there earlier. So the disadvantage is that you don't really get to choose. The advantage is that you get to get a bigger serving. So why do I have a box with me? Never mind. We'll just keep this here. I think I should have enough. Yeah. So, um, I mean, okay. Yes, they maybe they do wanna like uh, they do wanna close. But even if they don't, I believe they will still give you quite a lot for ten dollars USD, which is a lot. No, that economy rice stall dish that you showed would cost me 699 plus tax wait do you pay tax separately are you serious do you pay tax separately plus tax you mean you have to separately pay for the tax now that sounds a little um unheard of here definitely like everything has been like tax inclusive like tax included tax inclusive so um we don't really worry about tax on the prices we just pay whatever is there as is like it's always tax inclusive um roger said says you should be in hermit's craft hermit's craft one of the variations of minecraft um how did you get so much end rod roger said i have been playing for very long <laughs> i think i went to the end at around episode 70? 60? I don't know, 60 or 70, thereabouts. So it's been quite a while since I completed the end, and I've since gotten a lot of chorus fruits, and uh, a lot of uh, blaze rods. Um, admittedly, the blaze rods were harder to farm for, definitely. The blaze rods were way harder to farm, but nonetheless, we managed to get quite a lot of blaze rods. And therefore, um, a lot of androids. Yeah, um, like you can ask Asim. Asim has seen me farm Blaze, 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 and more Blaze. So, yeah. I've been farming Blaze, 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 and Blaze. <laughs> yep, cost plus 4% county plus 4% state tax, so 8% total. Wow, really, that dish, the one that I showed you, the one in the box that I showed you, the second picture, that would only cost $3 here with tax, like tax inclusive, $3, which is about USD $230, $220, yeah, USD maybe $220 or or 230 tax inclusive not tax exclusive so if you say four percent four percent eight percent so seven plus another eight percent that's um seven fifty six seven dollars fifty six cents that's very expensive very expensive haven't you made Blaze Farm, Roger Sid asks. Roger Sid, I have a certain area where the blazes really spawn very well because I've got two spawners side by side, so there's no need to make a Blaze Farm. Because the spawn rate is the same in, even in the Blaze Farm, right? So you still have to AFK there while you um, like farm for Blaze. So I don't intend to AFK farm. And that's why I, I decided not to go for the farm. Yeah. <laughs> Andrew says, HH, hi, hi, I guess. Um, Asim says, 
family run? Uh, are you asking whether it was family run? Like whether the shop was family run? No, it's not. It's always just basically um as a as a as a business. It's just a registered business. That's all. It's just like any other registered business. Like um it's not like a multi multinational corporation or like a like a conglomerate or something. But it's still quite it's still a company. It's a just a registered company. Excited for the new update, Roger Sid says. You mean the Netherite? The Nether update? I'm excited for it too. But not very excited because I already have a full set of mending diamond armor. That just messes things up. I have to remake all these armor and enchant them. With level 57, I'm worried I won't have enough EXP to enchant a full set of netherite armor. So, yeah, I'm still concerned about that right now. Like, I'm still trying to save up my EXP. Because I'm predicting that I don't think I have enough EXP for that. I have an EXP farm. I do have an EXP farm. From my gold farm, because you know, why not get both at the same time? But I haven't been getting much EXP because I've been using the gold farm to repair my tools rather than to like get EXP. So I've been using that to repair my tools instead. Yeah, now's the time to continue mining. Let's go mining. We oh, okay, wait, 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 wait. We should get some of these things. To help us build the sides. Uh, cut sandstones. Any more? Cut sandstones. Yeah. Let's cut a few more sandstones as well. Why not? Okay, let's do that. Any more? Uh huh. Okay. Yeah, so, um, Asim, in terms of your question, family run. I don't think there's anything about like family run or something here unless you're referring to something else but generally speaking like uh, if it's a family run business usually you just like uh, like you know not really usually but most of the time if you only visit very occasionally it'll be free of charge and even if it doesn't, you probably don't have to, like, you know, because if it's your own food, you don't really have to put it in as your own consumption. You just make one copy of the food for yourself and just eat the food. Oops, no, not there. I mean, two years ago, an egg McMuffin cost 150 This month, it went up to 349 Our state minimum wage went up to 13.75 an hour. So, of course, the stores jacked up their costs. Oh, because the, the stores need to pay more wages and therefore they increase their, course, their, their costs. And then what's the point? What's the point of increasing wages? Now everything costs more. It's, it's a little scary though, to be honest. Maybe I don't really understand economics well, but it's kind of scary how I think about that. But I don't think I want to mention these sensitive topics on stream, so yeah. <laughs> oh, anyway, tomorrow I might not be able to stream in the morning because um, like basically I'm trying to like let my family members uh, have more rest and reduce my um, like noise volume like when I talk and whatnot um, like there's a volume there so um, like there's a need for rest and therefore I don't think I'm able to stream tomorrow morning um, even tomorrow night uh, Minecraft stream may be cancelled um, in favor of in favor of um, Monday morning so I may stream on Monday morning but if but if okay if I decide to cancel tomorrow night's Minecraft stream as well fear not or fret not well I've recorded a new series not house flipper sorry but I've recorded a new series and I haven't edited it 
but I plan to bring it out tomorrow onto the channel. So there's going to be a new series out of maybe three new ones. So um, I'm taking a little bit more time to get uh, like um, the format for uh, Roller Coaster Tycoon. Yeah, format for Roller Coaster Tycoon ready. Uh, Minecraft. Of should I should I call your name like that? I mean, okay, your name is Minecraft F O O L apostrophe S. So I hope you don't mind me addressing you as your name is. But hi, welcome to the stream. Hello, greetings to you. I thought I'm bad enough to call myself a noob. <laughs> I thought that was bad enough already that I call myself a noob. <laughs> so, <laughs> so your name is Minecraft Fools with an apostrophe S, and I'm Minecraft Noob. Just that my name is not, it's not Minecraft Noob, but I am a Minecraft Noob. So, high five. I suppose, <laughs> high five. Yeah, I'm a Minecraft Noob. <laughs> I'm just trying to patch back the places where I dug out in order to continue. Um, I wonder how far this is. Uh, well, here is the deal. They will still make profit. Uh, they will still make... Hang on. They will still make a profit. However, the percentage of profit goes down... This affects the quarterly goals, which makes investors unhappy. Yeah, I mean, like, seriously, um, the fact that they actually raise their prices, that's pretty scary, though, because, like, uh, wages is pretty much limited to the number of employees you have. But when you raise, like, um, cost prices when, when you sell things, you actually get even more profit than just the increased wages. Uh, looking for two weeks? Uh, what do you mean, Yoda? Welcome to the stream, though. Well, everything they say is now possessive, so it's like they're high and it's they're, it's okay. Uh, what do you mean? What do you mean? This one I'm a little confused. I, I don't I don't I'm missing the context over there. I'm missing the context over there. What do you mean by uh, everything they say is not possessive? Uh, what you doing? Um, Minecraft fools. I'm actually building an underwater tunnel. I'm actually building an underwater tunnel right here to head towards um, the desert biome. So, yeah, it's part of the underwater project. Uh, just a joke, I'm so see you streaming again. Thank you, thank you, Yoda. Thank you, Yoda. Welcome back to the stream. Hello, greetings. Greetings, greetings. Uh, oh, oh, wait, I thought that was iron. <laughs> um, yeah, Minecraft Fools, basically this is my underwater tunnel from an underwater city. So maybe I'll show that to you later, just the underwater city. But let me um, at least make a little bit of progress on the underwater tunnel. So if you don't mind sticking around, chatting with us, um, as soon I'll be able to show you the underwater city, where this originated from, or actually passes through. I have a base, so it passes through the underwater city from the base, Uh, the apostrophe the apostrophe s makes everything they type possessive. So it's Minecraft fools hi and Minecraft fools what you do. Oh, okay, I get what you mean. So it's it's Minecraft fools um statements. <laughs> it's Minecraft fools statements <laughs> basically. <laughs> well, uh, uh, it's his statements anyway. So <laughs> I suppose it's okay. I suppose so. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, yeah. But anyways, um, back to the back to the topic. Like really though, um, 
it's really expensive to be honest the the food costs over there like um wages have increased and the food costs have increased so you know like what i mentioned just now like you know two meat and two vegetables it used to cost like maybe 380 it used to cost like 380 and some shops will sell it for 370 now it costs four dollars and some shops sell it for 390 so it increased by 20 cents but generally 20 cents per meal that's actually not too bad that's not too too bad Yeah, 20 cents per meal should be reasonable. Because um the food is really good. The food is really nice, so you know, they they deserve a, a price hike for the amount of effort they put into cook such really amazing food. But the price hike is also reasonable in a way. Because it's like just 20 cents per meal. I mean, it's not just, but generally speaking, um, the way I can save is to eat one less meat and just go for like one meat and two vegetables and that'll be fine. Instead of like two meat and two vegetables. So I'll be like ordering maybe one meat and two vegetables and not like order fish too often. So that should be okay. So, um, yeah, his, I didn't think Minecraft Fools was a masculine name, I mean Roger, Yoda, yeah, I could potentially assume his, still up in the air about Minecraft Fools though, oh yeah, true that, um, Minecraft Fools gender is still unknown right now, because we cannot really make the assumption, <laughs> I get what you mean there, Asim, I get what you mean there, we shouldn't be making assumptions, but Yoda most likely... Based on just based on the name, the trend of the naming. Based on the naming trend. So, true that, true that. How far is this island though? How far is this island? I wonder. How far will it take before we reach water? Let's see. Let's just go through. Let's just dig through. Straight through. Okay? Dig through. Uh, straight through. Let's see. How far is this? Let's go. Let's not fall into any crevices, though. Um, Dallas, good evening. Good evening, and good morning to you, actually. Good morning to you. Good morning. If this was a real house, it would cost one billion. Why would it, why would it cost one billion, uh, Minecraft Fools? Aha, uh -huh, there it is. Yay, we got through. Yay, finally we got through. Hehe. <laughs> so that's how far it is. Wow, look at this. This is how far it is. So my progress is wrong. I shouldn't chose I shouldn't have chosen that that method of progression. It was a mistake. It was a mistake, a great big mistake. But then again there was a lot of coal, so I had to had to do that sort of. Had to do that. Okay, let me just put this through here. Uh, I mean, Dallas, I can also assume is a guy, especially after what Debbie did. <laughs> uh, and Dallas is a guy. Dallas is a guy. Yeah, we don't need to assume <laughs> Dallas is a guy. Okay, let's uh, put that there. Fit that thing in for now. <gasps> Oops. Uh, look at this. Do you think a creeper can spawn here? I think it can. I think it can. I think creepers can spawn here. And that will be a disaster. 10 points for those who got the joke reference. I get zero. <laughs> I got zero points. Sorry. I didn't get the reference at all. I didn't get the reference. Nope. Not at all. As usual. I mean, why would I? <laughs> why would I get the joke, right? I'm so bad at jokes. 
Or would I get the joke? <laughs> I didn't. I didn't get the joke. So zero points for me. Okay, so we're probably gonna dig through like straight through and then we'll we'll fix the floor. Okay, let's dig through and then fix the floor. Um Where's your assumption? <laughs> Uh, where's my assumption? Um, I don't know how. So we're still we're still um debating whether your uh, or what's your gender. But um, actually, it's not really up for debate. Uh, regardless of your gender, you're always welcome here. So, <gasps> whoops! I hear thunder though. Ta-da! Souls assumed you were a guy. Oh yeah, yeah. I assumed you were a guy though. Sorry. I was just making like assumptions based on no no basis. I had no basis to make such an assumption though, so my apologies. Um. Okay. Uh, Minecraft fools. I'm going to show you my underwater city right now before we proceed. Yeah. I'm just gonna show you the underwater city. Let me just pick up a few of these blocks that are still there. I said I make no assumption as your name gave no hint. Yeah. Asim didn't actually make any assumptions. I was the one that made some assumptions. Right, let's go. Let's show Minecraft Fools our underwater city. Let's go. So it's just going to be the underwater city, nothing else. I'm not going to um, go all the way back to show the base. So the base, um, no, no show, okay? But the underwater city, I will show. Um, yes, I'm a guy. <laughs> okay, Minecraft Fools. Welcome to the stream, regardless of your gender. Welcome, welcome. Can a woman be named Dallas? I don't know. I don't know much about, like, I just know that the, the, um, the usual um, naming conventions, but um, conventions can be broken, right? So, yeah. It's just naming conventions. <laughs> Reminds me of programming. Reminds me of programming. Uh, Asymmetrical says, I have seen a woman whose name was Dallas, but it was her <coughs> stage name. <laughs> okay, okay, I see. I see. Dallas. <laughs> Dallas. Anyways, uh, this is the underwater city right here, so I'll give you a quick view. Ta da! Yep, the underwater city. We have a dome there, we have another dome here, and all that. So, maybe I give you a quick... Oh, no, not that one. Oops. Quick view of the inner part of the underwater city. <laughs> Dallas. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I don't know about, like, naming conventions and whatnot. I just know that, you know, just basically, um, like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't I don't really know much about naming conventions. Just know a little bit, that's all. And I'm basing off of the little bit of information that I know. Yeah, okay. So Minecraft Fools, this is the underwater city. Ta -da! We have the lighthouse, we have the main dome, we have the airlock, we have some of these domes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight domes in total. And two utility buildings. And let's go back to continue the tunnel. Yeah, just a quick um, quick diversion to show the underwater city. I always enjoy hearing Soul say da da when he's showing someone something. <laughs> oh my god, why? Why, why do you enjoy that? <laughs> oh my god. I mean, like seriously though, it, it's just it's just like you know surprise. <laughs> this is how it looks like. So yeah. Okay, let's go back. So we are only two hundred blocks away. Two hundred blocks away from our goal. No, not two hundred. Two hundred. And then make a turn and another hundred, or not turn and just make three hundred. 
So it's either 200 and a turn with 100 to 200 or 300 without turning. Yeah. Depends though. Lol? <laughs> why, why, why the laughter though? <laughs> Um, anyway, yes, uh, Minecraft Fools, that was the uh, underwater city that I built over many, many different episodes. So, um, yeah, I'm still trying to decide whether I'm going to end the series at 150 or 200. Not sure yet. I don't have a lot of things to bring to the, to the world anymore. So, we're just like seven, seven more projects, like I said. Yeah. Seven more projects, I think. Aquarium, aviary, um, pet house, chicken farm. Um, two railway stations. And uh, like a research lab or something. Also in reference to the joke, Soulswin, there is a certain video of a woman named Debbie and her experience with Dallas. Not our Dallas though, but a, su a substantial number of people from Dallas. Oh, I see. Okay, okay. Okay. There's a certain video. The certain is what concerns me though. Certain video. What's video? Uh, is it a very sensitive NSFW video? Because like the way you put it, certain video in, in inverted commas, uh, in, in quotes, I, I'm a little uh, <laughs> intrigued about, yeah, about what could be the video. Not that I'm gonna find or watch it, but still, you know, like. Curious, yes, curious. And yesterday, uh, no, not actually, yes, yesterday. I was saying temporarily, um, two hundred episodes. I mean, tentatively. That was a word I couldn't remember. Tentatively. Very NSFW. Okay, okay. Then let's not, uh, let's not bring that video up. <laughs> let's not do that. No, it's too, it's very NSFW. Then it is too NSFW for the channel. It's too unsafe for the channel. <laughs> Flipping table. What's up? What's up? What's happening? Don't flip that table. <laughs> oh my god. Why are you flipping table? What's happening? What's happening? Why are you flipping the table? Why are you flipping the table? Why are you flipping the table? Okay, we just gotta dig through here. It's even worse than like um, building underwater though, like to be honest. Because building underwater, you just build, you don't need to remove. But here, you actually have to remove. And with, uh, with breathing potions, you don't really have to worry about like um, surfacing for air. So that's that. So actually, this might be worse than. This might be worse than. Uh, building underwater. And yes, we are not going to leave the iron. Don't flip tables, kids. <laughs> yeah, don't don't flip tables. Um, you can. Uh, Instead, um, say hi, <laughs> or say ta <laughs> instead of flipping tables. No, 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 no. That that becomes that makes it very bad. <laughs> no, 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 no. Forget about that. Forget about that. Forget I said that. No, 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 no. That's not good. No, no. Don't make that uh something, um, vulgar. <laughs> don't make ta something vulgar. <laughs> Um, where's the efficiency 5 pick and enchantment bottles? Eagle, welcome to the stream. 
Enchantment bottles. Um, I've got some potions over there, but I'm not building underwater, so I don't need those potions yet. But when I do go build underwater, then I'm gonna take the potions. Yeah. At the moment, I'm not building underwater, therefore no need for potions. And I don't want to build on unstable ground as usual, like I always say. Therefore, we're going to remove those. Um, actually, to be honest, uh, we can build here. And then just continue like that. Yeah, I think we're fine. So this is the edge over here. And we're going to uh, dig through here. I will put it back. <laughs> Now that looks funny. Now that looks really funny. That looks really funny. Oh my god. <laughs> that looks really funny. Okay, anyways, um, talking about something funny, one of my episodes of the new series, I actually failed. So, yeah. I actually failed to, like, um, complete the game, so... Um, I don't know if I'm gonna make it like a, an episode or uh, just splice it in. Most likely splicing it in. Is Asymmetrical a viewer? Yes, Asymmetrical is a viewer. And my moderator also. Asym is my moderator also. Yeah. Uh, so let me get this straight. From what I heard earlier, I heard Soulswin say, Hey Asym, buddy of mine, your weekend is shot. At least that is what I think he said. Um, I'm a little confused. What do you mean? <laughs> uh, with reference to me not streaming? With reference to me cancelling some of the streams? <laughs> is, that, is, is that with reference to me cancelling some of the streams? Okay, you know what? I I think I think um I think I might not stream Minecraft though. And by the way, it is easier to just build in Nether cause eight overworld block equals to one Nether block. Uh eight Nether world block equals to one over one um eight Overworld block equals one nether block. Eagle, um, thank you for the information. Uh, but the reason why I'm not building it in the nether, as I've mentioned and explained many, many times, is because we have a gold farm. We have a gold farm where we use nether portals. Like... If we were to use nether portals for quick access, we're going to break the gold farm. So it is unwise to use the gold farm there, just because we're going to break the gold farm if we use the nether portal for traveling. So the nether portal was built further in order to not break the gold farm. How many weeks am I without Stardew? Um, three weeks at the very least. Three weeks. <laughs> Sorry. Maybe, maybe I'll just proceed with the stream. I think, I think, um, I'll, I'll see what's, uh, what's the condition and, uh, whether I can stream tomorrow. So I don't think I can confirm, but I'll try. I'm, I'm unable to confirm, but the least I can do is try. So um yeah maybe I'll we'll just proceed with the with the stream. Since I've edited most of the uh like Stardew Valley VODs anyway. So maybe I can continue with the stream. Hangs head in defeat and lay a hand on Eagle's shoulder. Believe me, friend. I and many other people have barked up that tree. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> yes, indeed. Many people have already recommended the same thing. Ego. Many people have recommended the same thing. It's just that um, it's for aesthetic purposes. There's many reasons 
you know, like I'm, I'm not trying to just get efficiency alone, okay? I'm also going for um, like aesthetics as well. So to make it look good. And also um, like to not break existing things. Like for example, we have a gold farm. I'm unable to shift the gold farm, you see. I'm not able to shift the gold farm. And therefore we'll have to work around it. And also... Um, the nether portal doesn't look nice. It just doesn't look nice. If you tell me I can choose other materials to build a nether portal, maybe I can use a nether portal for some of the other travels. Some, not all, some of the other travels. But the fact that the nether portal doesn't even look good. It looks very dark and, um, like, over overbearing. I don't like how the nether portal looks. So, um, yeah. In my survival, I built a bedrock level in the nether. Surprisingly, not much lava. Oh, okay. Okay, I see. You built it at the bedrock level and not much lava. Now that's interesting. I would expect a lot of lava over there. And Kitty, welcome to the stream. Hello, greetings to you. Greetings, greetings. Welcome to the stream. I'm still digging the tunnel as per normal. And we're making very little progress because, you know, we're digging through an island. Like, we're digging through the island. Therefore, like, we're not really making progress over here. Sadly. Kitty, welcome to the stream. I still remember your actual name though. Like, I actually do remember. I think you mentioned it before. Or was it a different name? That's all. Sorry. Okay, maybe it was just a different name. Different username. But anyways. Um, do you copy your Russian name? Um, I think ASIM just like basically control C, control V. If I'm not mistaken. Just basically control C, control V, just copy and paste. I don't know. Is it, was it like, did you type it out or was it like a copy paste? The co-monitor said the monitor is not following the rules. Uh, what do you mean? <laughs> I'm not getting jokes. Um, okay, Minecraft fools, you're new here. I just need to warn a very simple thing. If you try to tell me jokes you most likely will be face palming yourself because I am very bad at getting jokes, okay? I'm so bad at getting jokes, maybe you need a first aid kit to prevent yourself from getting hurt from face palming too much. I am bad at jokes. Very bad at jokes. So, just in case you hurt yourself from face palming too much, you may want a medical kit beside you when you attempt to tell me some jokes yeah Isim has been to the ER many times from telling me jokes so <laughs> I think you should prepare a, a med kit <laughs> before you attempt to tell me any jokes <laughs> because you'll be face palming yourself I won't get the joke most of the time I won't On the rare occasion that I do get the joke, you'll be so elated and so happy that you clap until you hurt yourself. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. I did, yes, once, and programmed one of my keyboard macros. Uh, oh, I see. So you typed, you typed, um, like, Russian language? You typed Russian language on your keyboard once. That's that's interesting. Um, I only have I think Korean and Japanese language, other than Chinese, of course. Um, I I and English, of course. I only have like Korean and Japanese, um, language packs installed. 
<laughs> what what is that though? I think that's like a meme or something. That's probably a meme. Okay, now let's continue. Uh Asim says, wear a helmet. Your head is going to come in contact with a brick wall on many occasions. And a micro fool says, okay, helmet, syringe, and um, capsules ready on standby. Yes, please. Please. If you tell me jokes, I most likely won't get it. Anyway. Ah, Sandstone, my favorite block. Hey, um, Seth, welcome to the stream. Hello. I hope you're not bored by this, but I'm just uh, building. I'm just building. I'm still building. As usual, I'm still building. And I need to take uh, the link from ASIM. I don't know what this is. Oh, but I'm. Oh, I see. That's what it is. Okay. I'm gonna keep it there and then listen to that later. <laughs> I, I think I know what it is. What it is. But yeah, I'm just gonna keep it there and then listen to that later. Yeah, Sandstone, my favorite block. No, 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 Sandstone is not my favorite block, said. My favorite block is the rail. Definitely the rail. No, I copied it with Control c and pasted it onto the G8 key of my Logitech keyboard. Huh? G8? G8 key? What is that? Ah, uh, Sandstone, hey. And, um, that... That sounds, that seems, um, the one that Kitty typed there seems like an owl's eye. Like, it looks like an owl. O-W-L, O-W-L, owl. Let's spell owl. O-W-L, owl. <laughs> yeah, it looks like an owl. It looks like an owl. Oh my god, now I'm concerned about how to proceed from here. How should we proceed? How? How should we proceed there? Let's add more. Uh, I gotta be sooner here. Oh, it's okay. No worries. Um, anytime you're free, don't you don't have to like uh like you know always be like uh too concerned about not coming on time. Don't worry about that. Yeah, just just uh, just be here when whenever you feel like it, and whenever I'm streaming, though, <laughs> of course. Yay, we duck through everything. Cool. Now it's back to water again. Yippee yahoo! Yay! <laughs> Yippee yahoo! Yay! It's back to the water again. Um. It's a macro key. Oh, I see. I don't think I have any macro keys, though. Like, mine's the, um... Stealth Raptor Armageddon MK something, I think. It's a, it's basically a Stealth Raptor um, from Armageddon, the, the company. Sorry for the burping there. My apologies. It's, it's bad, I know. Sorry. Um, don't know why it's a little burpy there. QWERTY! <laughs> QWERTY! Nah, it's not QWERTY. It's just... My, my keyboard's a QWERTY keyboard, though. My keyboard's a QWERTY keyboard. I don't know if I'm ever going to get used to not using a QWERTY keyboard. Mine's definitely QWERTY. <gasps> Oops. <gasps> Wait, what? How's that still... Oh, right, of course. Okay. So over here, we're going to start with uh, glass and then outwards, okay? It's pretty cool though, like passing through another island like that. Pretty, pretty cool, pretty good looking. Okay, and we also need to go to the surface to pick up any blocks that we missed because no way, I'm not gonna let any blocks go missing. Nope, not possible, not possible. Not going to lose blocks like that. Uh, okay, here. And then, uh, here, this one. Hey! Oh, okay, thank you. Here. Aha, uh -huh, that's it. So, um, like that. Like that. 
and that's all. So this part, right, actually I think we do have to use style right over here, like this one. I think we do have to use dial right, so I'm going to replace it with dial right. Because it looks weird, half half, like that. So I'm gonna replace it with dial right. Oh, oh. Yeah, dial right. Dial right, we. <laughs> Undo everything and then replace it with dial right. <laughs> Okay, that's it. Wait, wait, did I use dial right previously though? I think I did. I think I did, so uh, we're gonna find out, okay? We're gonna find out. Did I use dial right previously? Let's go find out. Um, my keyboard model is this one. Okay, let me, let me take a look at your keyboard model. Let me take a look at your keyboard model. Give me a moment, please. Thank you. Thank you. Keyboard model. Uh, Turbo Squid. Oh my god! Oh my god! This looks so good! OMG. It looks so good! I want something like that. I want something like that too. Can I have something like that as well? Please? <laughs> Please? May I? No, just kidding. Anyways, um, let's go back and see. Did we put um, dial rights for... Uh, no, not yet. Sleep first. Sleep first. Um, yeah, so basically... I... I don't know. I'll try to stream tomorrow morning, but even if I do, it might be a short stream. It might be a short stream. So, yeah. Today's stream won't be too long either. I think I'm gonna end at about, um, I hope 11. 11.30 just because like my family needs some rest so I'm gonna accord them the rest they need by not being so um, noisy especially during this period of time I think they need to rest so like I mean they always need to rest it's just that um, yeah this is a, a, a more sensitive period of time whereby you know with the virus um, ongoing uh, it's good to stay healthy, even more, like, you know, even healthier than before, just to be stronger, just in case, yeah. <laughs> what did Minecraft fool's type? Why do you type this, though? I'm gonna show this one time, though, but any reason for that? <laughs> oh, I think you're trying to test out your um, keyboard, is that it? Yeah, okay, we did uh, dial right, so so it's okay. Okay, let's go back. So we did dial right. Okay, so anyways, uh, yeah, basically, wait, Kitty said I gotta be sooner, or... Oh wait, did did Kitty mention that Kitty has got to go and I don't know, did I did I miss saying goodbye to some others? Like Dallas, did Dallas say Dallas is leaving? Anyways, um thanks for all who had left but had dropped by, thank you for watching. Because I think I might have uh, missed saying goodbye to some. Um, I'm watching this on a tablet. Ooh, tablet. How does it perform on the tablet, though? Like, um, is the quality okay? Like, I'm streaming on 1440 maximum, so, um, like, okay, basically, based on my setting, like, the setting option on YouTube Studio, 
a maximum is 1440 but uh, my streaming software is configured for um, 1920 by 1080 yeah my streaming software has been configured configured for 19 20 by 1080 just that you know the stream itself will be broadcasting at a uh, lower um, lower resolution I don't know if I've got enough diorite though I'm really worried about having not enough diorites very very concerned because if I don't have enough diorite, you know what that means. It's mining time. Yeah. And Dallas has sat through so many mining. Of course, same goes for asymmetrical. Even more, in fact. So, I would want to avoid mining if I can. Not yet. Not recently, at least. But... I think it is almost unavoidable. Almost unavoidable. Almost. Oops. Okay, let's uh shovel. Dig this out. Okay, uniformity, very important, right? Uniformity, very important. Uh, hey, wait, what? How did this happen? Because of uh, the gravel? Okay, I suppose that's okay. Now we can finally resume this. Ah ha ha, yeah. Finally. Right, so no oxygen, so let's go back inside and let's uh, get this thing ready. Let's go! <laughs> gotta, gotta replace all of these ones again. And then we're back out in the open where we can continue building. Okay, so um, Minecraft Fools, I actually have... Um, a base at home like basically like where I spawned where I first spawned on this world on this seed I have a huge base over there it's not really tip-top condition yet but it's a really good base and um, I can show it to you later when I need to go to do some mining Okay, let's at least remove some of these, shall we? At least take some diorites that are within reach. Now let's continue there. And then here. So maybe maybe later, um I don't know. I, I don't I don't know if I'm going to like stream Stardew Valley tomorrow to be honest um asim would it be okay if i stream something else because i'm i'm dedicating some of my time to edit uh you know the uh the new series and to prepare for the new series so i, I don't want to have too many votes for stardew valley pending over there so, um, if I stream something else that I won't be editing, would that be okay? Instead of Stardew Valley? W would that be fine? So, like tomorrow morning, I'll be streaming something else that's not Stardew Valley. Kitty says, do you know how to copy YouTube link? I'm a noob about it. Um, YouTube link? Where are you watching from though? Are you watching from a browser? on your PC or are you watching from um, a device and uh, second question is 
where do you intend to copy the link to? What do you intend to bring the link to? So where is the destination of your link? Do you want to share it somewhere? Or do you want to just like keep a copy of the link? So by answering that, maybe I'll be able to help you. Because I need to know where is the destination of your uh, link. This live stream, of course. Um, yep, yep. Um, yes, uh, uh, Minecraft Fools. I mean, like, um, where where would Kitty want to like share the link to? For example, do you, does Kitty want to share it on WhatsApp? Because there's like on a mobile phone, there are some ways to share the link. So like you go to your YouTube app, if you have one, if you don't, then it's an entirely different approach again. So that's the reason why I'm asking. So basically, um, yeah. Oh, to put the link on here. Okay, basically, Kitty, um, link sharing is only available to moderators. So, um, what would you like to share, though? What would you like to share? Sorry about the delay. I have a QWERTY keyboard, but as I touch type, it is in the uh, Dvorak layout. So instead of QWERTY and QWERTY, I get... Uh, PY and did it PY. <laughs> I see. Okay. It's okay. No worries. Take your time. Take your time. Five, six. Oh, hang on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yep. <clears throat> yep. Here. Here, here, insert here, oh, just forget, ah, I see, it's okay, no worries, oh, ASDFG, it becomes AOEUI, so, um, instead of ASDFG, ASDFG, the, the vowels are there, so the vowels are in the middle line, I see, I see, oh, that's interesting, though. That's very interesting. Devora. So that's what it is. Insert sad violin meme for Kitty here. Oh, I know the violin meme. Um, um. Uh, 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 how can I can I can I launch a different application right now and uh, perhaps uh, really make the violin meme there? <laughs> I have a music application that can make the meme. They can make the violin thing. I, I know what, what you're referring to, if I'm not mistaken. I think, I think so. I think that I know the meme that you're specifically referring to. But, um, yeah, froggy theme. A oh, froggy meme. Oh, I see. I see, okay. Um, yeah, basically, um, only mods are able to share links on here. But um, for other viewers, though, if you want to share, like, something, just let me know what you intend to share. I'll just search for it after the stream. And then I'll be able to, like, answer you uh, later. Or I can search it on my phone and then be able to respond to you after that. So that would be fine too. If it's like you, you really do want me to know now, I can actually like, you know, search it. Um, oopsie, I made a mistake. It's supposed to be diorite here, but it's fine. We're, we're going to get the diorite first. Let's go. Let's go get diorite. Diorite, polish diorite, diorite. I know the meme, like seriously, I know exactly what meme you're referring to, um, Minecraft Fools. I know exactly which one you're referring to. It's just, I'm not able to hum it out because, um, 
I'm not good at uh, singing or even humming it out. So yeah. So 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 that's why I'm uh, not able to do that. The world's smallest violin meme. meme. I don't know if it's the world's smallest meme though. Is it? Is it the world's smallest one? I don't know. I don't know in regards to that. Maybe it is. That one I'm not too sure. Aha! We see monsters below! We see monsters below! Yeah, is it gonna target us? No? Okay. Uh, frog is... Frog wins pigs? Why? What do you mean? Let's get some more of these uh, diorites. They're right here. So let's get them. Shall we? They're conveniently placed. The world's smallest. We see... We see... We see sea monsters below. <laughs> we see sea monsters below. Yes, we see sea monsters below. Yeah. Sea zombies. We see sea zombies below. Let's get some diorite. I mean, it's within reach without uh, much uh, concern about like maybe even like patching this place up if I don't want to, but I will. You know that I will. I always do. Uh, actually, though, is it necessary? I think it is necessary. I think it is necessary. Um, you know what? I'm just going to patch up the rest. We're not going to take all the diorite because I don't want to, like, really uh, go too far out. Like, you know what? Forget it. It's just right here. It's only right here. What's stopping me from taking it, right? What's stopping me from taking it? Take it. Take it. Take it. Take it. Take it. It's diorite. It's diorite. Don't wait any longer. Take it. Diorite. Take it. Take it. It's diorite. Well, who am I kidding? I need diorite. Let's take it. I need as much diorite as I can get. Uh, we see sea monsters, so you could see through in some Spanish sea. We see sea monsters below. Oh, yeah. Like, um, in Spanish, yes is sea. Yes, we see. Sea. We see sea monsters below. C monsoir, right? C monsoir. Is it monsoir or what? Uh, monsieur. Monsoir, monsieur. Mon monsieur. <laughs> monsieur. So, yeah, monsters from the sewer. <laughs> monsieur. Monsters from the sewer. Right? Is that is that what monsieur means? Like monsters from the sewer? Maybe, maybe not. Okay, now I don't want like drowned zombies creeping up behind me. Not now, please. I'm trying to focus on patching this place up so that, you know, we can properly do what we need to do. We see, 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 see monsters below. That many see though, <laughs> that many sees. Why? Why so many C's? <laughs> Why? Any reasons for the number of C's there? Any particular reason for the number of C's there? We see, 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 see monsters. Any particular reasons? There are so many C's over there. <sighs> okay, good enough. Good enough. We're done. We're done. Let's uh, go, let's uh... No, 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 let's not go yet. Let's uh, put these in here. We see C below before monsters. Uh, okay. Why not above? <laughs> okay, never mind. Anyways, I get what you mean. Somehow, I think. I suppose. Uh, okay, we'll deal with that later. Let's patch this up fully. For this time round, we're gonna 
make sure that everything is accounted for. Let's go. A sailor went to the CCC. A sailor went to the CCC to see what he could see. CCC. Uh, but all he could see, 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 was the very blue bottom of the C, C, C. Okay, the the double E one I get, but not the S E A one. I don't, I don't get the S E A one, but I get the double E one. Like the double E, basically, you want to see someone called C, see what that person. Like basically, um. I can replace with a sailor went to the CCC, which I don't get, to see what he could see delta C. But all that he could see delta C was the very blue bottom of the CCC, which I don't know. Yeah. Give sight fight to so CCCC SH do. He had just its high do do do. To it's about high. What what do you mean? <laughs> now that feels more like an autocomplete, you know, like you're trying to autocomplete something. And that feels more like an autocomplete. It's a song, you're really thinking it. Yes, I I was actually thinking it. Yeah, I was actually thinking it. I didn't think it was a song. Yeah, so like I said, you know, this is the face palm moment. Yep, I do overthink. Very often. I do sort of like overthink very often. So, uh, yeah. Like, I, I, I commonly overthink. Very commonly. Think too much. <laughs> Forces Studio, sorry, what? Sat sat satisfied taking. I'm I'm lost. I'm lost now. What do you mean? Well, I burp. Thank you. Sorry. Next time round, I'm gonna mute if I burp, unless it's uh it's an unexpected burping. Cause uh, it's bad. Yeah, look at this. I even got these things all f spaced out really nicely without actually like intending to do that. So that's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. Okay. Oh my god, more dial right below. Never mind, we're not gonna touch them. We're gonna we're not gonna touch them diorites. Not there. Uh <laughs> kitty put that thing again. The 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 other uh emote. Is it called an emote or emoticon? Oops, 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 oops. Like, is it an emote or emoticon? Or emoji? Is it emoji, emoticon, or emote? Uh, okay, this is... Uh, cut set... Uh, cut set stone, yeah. It's called a... Dongle? What? What's a dongle? I'm lost again. It's autocorrection. Fans so do 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 Travis. Oh wait, actually. Um I saw this uh like tweet on Twitter. Basically it's like a fun tweet to ask people to like type down their um basic suggestion. Like if you uh, have like say for example open your whatsapp or something or just open your phone like me basically like a messaging app and then try to um, start with um actually and then complete the sentence with autocorrection and see what you get so what do you get with um actually just pick the very uh, first suggestion I believe I don't know I think whatsapp don't 
One time I've got three different suggestions, so you don't really get to pick, like, the right one, which is usually in the middle. So, um, yeah. Were we saying this is a donger? Oh, I see. Okay, donger. So that's what it means. Okay, cool. I, I, I don't know, actually. I, I'm just, like, really lost. <laughs> I'm just really lost there. Now I know what it means. Ah, that's interesting. Basically, it's like a... Like a bespectacled um, sunglass person. To the, the unable Endar by... Okay. So, um, how about, you know, like, just... Um, unless it is uncouth or, um, like, profanities or anything that is NSFW, but if not... Maybe you could uh, type out what your suggestion is um, for the autocorrect. When you type um, the, uh, what do you call that? Um, start with um actually, like U-M-M, -M, um actually, and then see what your phone autocorrects for you. See what your phone autocorrects when you type um actually. I'll try out on my phone too. I'm um, I'm actually excited to W E we You mean you mean the predictive text challenge? Yes, correct. The predictive text challenge. In a way, but it's like you you, you have a starting phrase which is um actually No, 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 no. It's it's supposed to be um actually, but if your phone auto corrects it to I'm actually, that's fine. That's fine. Just just proceed with that. It's okay. Because like some people actually will have their phone corrected to become I'm actually. Type one word and suggest uh, type one word and just click on the middle word appears in the suggest suggested word list. Yep, something like that. Correct. Correct. Something like that. So what do you all get? You start with um actually. Yep. Yep, that's what Asim said basically. So um Asim said and then continually click on the middle word to get your sentence. Yep. That's right. So that's what I mean. So what do you all get with that? Oh, and that one is actually a donger. It's not an emoji, I see. And now I get what you mean. Took me a while. So it's not emoji, it's not emo, it's called a donger. Interesting. Yeah, uh, it took me a while to to uh, wrap my brain around that, you know, the fact that that thing is called a donger <laughs> and not an emoji. The texting when you swipe in the blue line appears. Yep. Let me, let me also, let me also try. What do I get? What do I get? Um, actually, I also don't find it was a spoiled choice. No, no, no. That was on the side, so I should pick the middle one. Um, actually, hung out with your UAT user acceptance test in a rush of a certain amount in your new semester to see tour of your friend and the ink of your way in a relationship with your friend and your usual time i okay never mind i think that's all after that after that it feels like a new sentence already so yeah <laughs> so that that was that was uh that was uh mine that was mine i just read it all out <laughs> Yeah. Well, would you look at that? Um, actually, Soulswin is the greatest streamer on <laughs> what? <laughs> How does it know this? And why is it asking my thoughts as well? Oh my god! Please stop! This isn't what I wanted. <laughs> I think you make this up. Okay, I think you make this up. I think you make this up. 
Mm, no, 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 no. That's not possible. You made that up. Definitely. Definitely, no doubt. No doubt about it. You made it up. Why would that even be something suggested? <laughs> I think, yeah, I think. <laughs> I think you made it up. Why would that even be suggested anyways? No way. I think you made it up, right? <laughs> just to, just to, like, you know, make me not feel so bad. <laughs> I was just playing the headphones. Oh my god. What do you mean? Uh, um, Minecraft rules. What do you mean? Oh, as in... Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. That was your autocorrect? Are you serious? That was your autocorrect? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, now that sounds a little wrong. <laughs> That sounds a little wrong, if that's your autocorrect. That actually sounds a little bit wrong. 54. Okay. And then... Hang on, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Here and then here. Uh, yeah, it's um. Wait, are you serious? Is that really what was in the suggestion, though? I mean, like, I'd be surprised, really. Uh, yeah, I'd be surprised to be honest. Thirty-five to twenty-five. And then 25 to 15. This one here. And then 15 to 5 here. No, mine is suggest um actually have a good night. <laughs> uh, and and that is where it stops. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. <laughs> 15, 9, 2, 49. I mean, but that's that's probably usually what uh, you would say, right? Not in suggestions like that. Oh, I see. Yeah, I mean, like, most of the times that's what you would say. Like, you know, actually have a good night. Yeah, that would be, that would be something more expected than, than, than just now what you typed, though. Like, seriously. Andrew Gaming says, hey, hey, Andrew Gaming. Welcome back to the stream. Just now you were here, but I think you stepped away for a little while. So welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. And we don't have enough rails. Oh, we got a good top up. So... Guess who's having rails? Guess who's having rails? Bang. And then put these back. Oopsie. Oopsie. No, not really. It's this one and this one. And then we need to power these rails. Um, Genesis? Genesis? Really? You mean the console? I don't have the console though, so I wouldn't... I wouldn't be able to tell if I like the console. I think it... I think I believe that's a console, like a gaming console. So, um, I... I don't know about the console, I don't have that. So I wouldn't be able to tell. I don't think I've even seen it before. I heard of a console with the name Genesis in it, but that's all. So, I won't be able to tell. Oh, starting off with, today I was pretty good as well. Today I received service from, uh, Brittany. I have no idea who she is, but I don't think my wife will be happy to find <laughs> Oops, I think you better um, uh, use the phrase more often. I received service from um, Veri Verizon, Verizon or T-Mobile. Just keep on typing until it suggests T-Mobile instead of... <laughs> yeah, instead of the name. <laughs> Just in case, you know, just in case. 
You don't want to have that suggestion there, do you? <laughs> yeah. It could spell trouble. It could spell trouble. T R O U B L E. Spell trouble. <laughs> It could spell trouble. Yes, I can spell trouble too. <laughs> T R O U B L E, trouble. That's how you spell trouble. T R O U B L E. <laughs> trouble. Yeah, I spell trouble. T R O U B L E, trouble. <laughs> how do you spell trouble? T R O U B L E, trouble. Okay, put these back in there. Let's go. And Minecraft Fools also says re. Wait, Minecraft Fools? You remind me of someone. Lava King plays. You remind me of Lava King plays. Yeah. The fucking place does this as well. What is comes up with what is the best way to give cash tip? Um, like, I don't know, actually. Basically, we don't have, like, you know, when we go dining at the local, um, like, food stores and whatnot, we don't really, uh... Because there's like service charge and all that, so most of the time, unless it's like at a restaurant, then you um like you can give like cash tip, but um most of the time like uh you don't really give cash tip here. But I mean, if you want to say like in US how to give like cash tip, um, I suppose I don't know because here like like red packets are auspicious, so. If you really do want to give a cash tip, you will wrap it in a red packet and just give the like leave the red packet at the table for um for the like the service people to to take. Um, I'm playing with the fidget spinner. Oh, I I know fidget spinners, but but you know like sometimes they actually kind of like distract students even more that you know schools may even ban a uh, fidget spinner just to just to prevent even more distraction like you know i think i've heard about this maybe i'm wrong maybe it's just um like fictitious i don't know but fidget spinners i have never tried one before yeah but anyways um how come is the longest what do you mean how come is the longest how come it's the longest? Huh? Okay, that I'm confused. That I'm confused. But anyways, yeah, so, like, if you want to give, like, um, cash tip at, a, like, a restaurant or something, then I suppose the best way to do it would be, you know, just, uh, just, like, leave it with your bill, or just hand it over to the, like, to the service personnel. Re yes, we read doo doo. Oh, okay. I think that's still like um a uh, uh an autocorrect if I'm not wrong. If I got that right, I think that's still um an autocorrect. Potions. Where are my other potions though? Huh? How do I only have these potions? What? Am I still missing something? Did I... Did, did I miss some potions, really? Did I lose some potions? Like, you know, they despawned? Did they despawn? Along the way? I know I have more potions than that. I know I have more potions than that, definitely. How come you all you are all well and good at the moment as I will not be able to make it to my car repairs or holiday panicking in the initial stages of development uh hang on let me let me observe where my potions are 
Am I really missing potions? We've been through here though. Am I really missing potions? I, the L, go by high. What? Uh, okay, I am lost there. Anyways, um, um, initial stages of development, and I am not a professional or anything. Ooh, ooh, okay, now that's, that's, uh, that's with reference to your, um, software designing and, uh, app development, I believe. And I believe I lost a few items to these bonds. I believe I lost some items to despawning. I'm sad now. I'm sad now. I think something despawned. Yeah. See? Only these potions, really. Yeah, I think they despawned. I'm really sad now. Which means I could have lost iron and end rods as well. To despawns. OMG OMG I could have lost those to these ones too Oh my god Okay, 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 uh Minecraft fools, I get what you mean there, I get what you mean there Now, um, I'm a little bit concerned because I think I've lost a lot of items through despawning. I think I brought a lot of, uh, like, materials with me, and then they despawned. I'm going to check. I'm going back to base to check because I am certain I brought a lot of potions with me. And despawning is not good. Goliath, is that you? Goliath? Um, welcome to the stream. Or G-O-L-I-A-T, go, uh, go something. I don't know how to pronounce that. Go, Lee, at, is that right? Welcome to the stream though, hi. No, despawn. Why? Yeah, exactly. I think and I suspect it's a despawn. I suspect it's a despawn, but I need to verify if that's uh that's true. I've got to go back to the base and then verify if I lost them to despawns. Cuz I might have taken far too long and then forgot all about those things and then eventually caused a despawn like the items just despawned which means that it could have been also end rods as well not just um not just my potions but also end rods and the other items that i had like end rods is very difficult to get because of the blaze rods um We've got many others, so I may have to review my vault later. I hope that the potions are in here. But I'm really worried though. I think I lost them. I think I did, I lost them. Let's see. Oh, okay, it's fine, we didn't. Okay, cool, cool. <laughs> okay, I, I'm... I'm I'm just panicking too much. Okay, sorry. <laughs> also, for those who want to ask an exclamatory question, instead of using question mark, exclamation, or exclamation question mark, um, introduce yourself to the intero... What? Interobang? Interobang? Intero bang. Uh, intero what? Bang, bang. Um. Uh. How do you even type that? How do you even type this? I mean, I'm copy and pasting. 
what? I mean, okay, I get what it means. I get what it looks like. But, uh, really? How do you type something like this? On the Dvorak, um, keyboard? On the Dvorak keyboard? This is, this is intriguing and very interesting too. But really though, are you serious? Okay, let me also go online and check something. While well, we're heading towards our destination. I need to find out some information from here. Wow. Oops, sorry. Oh my god, okay. GG. GG. I'm using QWERTY keyboard. Um, Minecraft Fool says I'm using QWERTY keyboard. Ooh, I see. I mean, I'm also using QWERTY keyboard. Most of us... Oh, wait. Mm, because Minecraft Fools... Wait, Andri is from Indonesia, but Minecraft Fools, where are you from? Which country are you from? Maybe I can write that down. Where are you from? It's not a key on the keyboard. Yeah, I, I would expect it to not be a key, but how did you come up with the key combination to get uh, the symbol? Yeah, I, my question is... How do you come up with a key combination for the symbol? Like, what is the right key combination to type that um, that symbol? And is it really called Interobang, or um, is it just a name that you come up with? Like, was it a name that you came up with, or is it legit called Interobang? Interobang. I'm gonna. I'm gonna write it down because I want to learn more about it. Interesting though. Okay, anyways, anyways, back to the topic. Um, 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 um. I'll be bringing a few new series to the channel. Like, um, one of them being... Roller coaster tycoon, like I've mentioned before. I'm still thinking about bringing another three more to the channel to make it four. So there's going to be four more new series, while the main series still takes more time to be completed. Um, I'm going to bring in way more raw series, like raw let's play series. But I'll really have to decide on, like, uh, the main Let's Play series, though. Okay, I have got a few episodes recorded, like I've mentioned before. It's just that, you know, um, I sort of, like, uh, I really played it raw, so much so that I don't know what's going on in the game, and therefore failed really badly. Like, you really see me fail in there, like, within the first... Uh, like the second mission or the third mission I had failed and like the character just died inside Ooh, we are almost dying attacked we're under attack we are under attack oops it's 11 o'clock wiki interobang ooh really there's something called interobang indeed like legit very, very interesting. So, okay, I think and I suppose and I hope that the wiki article will tell us what to do to get the symbol. Do more Minecraft live streams. Um, uh, yeah, basically, Minecraft fools. The thing is that the channel 
like, you know, it's not just focus on Minecraft. I'm a variety content creator. So, yeah. Um, I'll actually work on other... Oh, okay, the alt code. Oh, oh, okay, okay. I missed that. I missed that message. I literally, you know what? The thing is this. It, I was looking at it, but there wasn't anything there. I think maybe it's it's like blind spot. It's my eyes blind spot. Um, it's alt code two or three D, so it doesn't work in Chrome. But if you type two or three D in Microsoft Word, then press alt X right after it. It will turn into the intro bang. Oh, I see. Now that's interesting. So it only works with like um sort of like a, f a word processor. I wanted to say food processor. No, a word processor doesn't work alone, like standalone, but with a word processor. Okay, so basically it's a two o three D. I see. Um. Minecraft fool says I subbed. Thank you. Thank you for the sub. Um, welcome. Welcome to the channel And like I said, I'm a variety content creator. So it's not just Minecraft. I have a lot of other game series um, One of which will end today. Basically the series is ending today and that is uh, Infinite Factory. I'm going to make available the remaining episodes for the game series and um, I think if I can before 12 tomorrow morning, I'll finish editing and uploading the new game series if I'm not streaming tomorrow morning. Okay, if I'm not streaming tomorrow morning, I'll do that. Uh, yeah, and also, um, Asim, um, I was asking whether would it be okay if I don't stream Stardew Valley tomorrow morning, but a different game? So that I will not need to edit the VODs and I can focus more time on a new series. Or the VODs can come out later, definitely, but still, you know, they're, they're really uh, more time consuming because like, you know, every morning I tend to have uh, like sinus problems so, um, yeah. But actually, I stream Minecraft also in the morning. I just don't know why I tend to have way more sinus issues when I stream Stardew Valley for whatever reason. So, you know. I do want to make progress. Like, we are still stuck in year one. Like, we've not even gone to winter of year one. So, I do want to make progress. But, um, like, streaming other games allow me some time to not edit VODs because, you know, like, you know, I'll be streaming, uh... Okay, I'll just say this heads up for now. Um, do you get the name for the new series? What do you mean by the name of the... You Do you mean the name of the game for the new series? Um, Minecraft Fools? And also Minecraft Fools, once again... Um, which country are you from? You haven't mentioned it. Which country are you from? Where, where do you come from? Uh, okay. If you're asking about the name of the game for the new series, I'll say one of them is Roller Coaster Tycoon. The rest, I'll keep them a suspense. The rest, I'll keep them in suspense. But for tomorrow's stream, if I'm not streaming Stardew Valley, and if I'm streaming, um, just to give a heads up, Asim, it's going to be StarCraft 2. I'm going to play StarCraft 2 co-op. So tomorrow's game, if it's not Stardew Valley, and if I'm streaming, it will be StarCraft 2 co-op mode. So if you do play StarCraft 2, we can co-op. Let me know if you're keen. I suppose you would have StarCraft 2. So if you would like to play co-op, let me know. We'll do co-op.
So we can play together. Hi. <laughs> Yeah, so basically tomorrow's one will be um, StarCraft 2 Co-op. Um, I do not that great at it. It's been many years since I played the campaign. Well, that's fine. I mean, co-op is co-op. There's nothing related to the campaign. It's just taking story elements from the campaign and using about 2-3% of it. Like basically the characters and some of the iconic maps from the campaign. And then... Um, building upon them in the co-op mode it's not uh, like you know it's not really something that's like very um, um, campaign oriented and uh, if you're saying you're not good at it then you're better than me because you're saying you're not good at it I'm saying I'm bad at it so yeah but that won't prevent us from playing Brutal difficulty. Nope. We're going to play brutal. Even if we're not good at it, it's a good challenge. We're playing brutal campaign. I mean, brutal um, difficulty. <laughs> this is QWERTY what? Hill? Why do you say hill though? QWERTY and hill. <gasps> Look at so many enemies. Hi. And that one is like just spin dancing around. No damage. Yeah, first time, zero damage against three zombies. Um, Brutal? I think I may rather watch. You know, Brutal isn't that bad, to be honest. It, it really isn't that bad. Really. It, it's not, it's not, don't worry. It's fine. Twenty one, twenty, ten, nine. Okay, there. Uh, thanks, Isim. Thank you. I I didn't I didn't really. Uh, okay. No, anyways. Just curious, just curious, just curious. Okay, thank you, thank you. Yeah, so basically, um, we'll, we'll see. So, um, Isim, are you keen on the co-op? If yes, um, after the stream, which is about to end in maybe, like, say, for example, uh, another, um, 15 minutes. I think I want to end the stream earlier just to uh, reduce the amount of disturbance to my family because uh, yeah they, they they need a little bit more sleep today than usual oh okay that one is a trident zombie no wonder I couldn't see the trident there so yeah it's okay so basically um if you're up for the co-op uh, okay, Minecraft Fool says bye. Minecraft Fool, where are you from? Which country are you from? If you don't mind. Uh, but if you really don't want to disclose that, that's fine. Um, at least, uh, please do let me know that you would rather prefer not to disclose it. Also, if it is this morning, remember it is Saturday night for me and I can watch, but I have other obligations as well. It is if he streams tonight. Uh... Oh, I see. Okay, if he streams tonight, then you need to have um, some other obligations. I understand. I understand. No worries about that. No worries about that. Oh, Rin. Rin doesn't play RTS games. Rin. Rin doesn't play RTS. Rin. Rin's not an RTS person. Rin's more of a survival game, um, FPS game person. Or Stardew Valley, basically like a simulation game or something, but not an RTS game. RTS is very far from Rin, Rin's preferred genre. Yeah. 
The only genre that Rin don't really play is the RTS one. The other is, um, sort of. Sort of. Oh, I hear Enderman. Oh, Enderman's inside. Really, really inside here, huh? Inside, in the base. Really, in the base. Ooh. Oh, oh, oh my god. Oh my god, attacked. That's scary. That's really scary. Like, if you sleep near the Enderman, it says that you're staring at the Enderman and it attacks you. Are you serious? Are you serious? Oh, underwater is mortal enemy. Yeah, it's underwater. This is like a safe haven for the Enderman. Uh, no. Okay, peaceful mode. I don't care. Peaceful mode. No, no Enderman. No way. I should have just killed it before sleeping, seriously. I should have just killed it before sleeping. Yeah. That was that was nasty. I, I was thinking because like okay, I still got shocked, just that you know, I was thinking most likely it's going to attack because that's what the game does. It it throws um like unexpected things at you. So that's what the game will do. So I wasn't absolutely taken aback, but I was still shocked by the sudden attack. Um, I don't know. SC2 Brutal Difficulty seems pretty much like a fight for survival. No worries about that. You know what? Um, just in case you have got um, obligations, um, how about we end the stream and then we, we, have, a, we have a playthrough. How about we have a playthrough? I mean, I'll have to change my setup for, um, like, uh, StarCraft tonight, so, um, yeah. So, I'll switch over to Twitch, like, the Twitch setup, and we can play one game first. Because it's daytime for you, right? So, no obligations, like what you mentioned just now. So, maybe, do you want to play now? Would you like to play one, one or two rounds now? Uh, I would so love to watch it and I can play along through chat. Yep, true that, true that. I mean, if you really want to just watch, it's okay too. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, I mean, if you really want to, if you prefer to play just through chat, that's fine too. No worries about that. Okay, I'm not going to keep those there because I'll miscalculate. I'll miscalculate, definitely. So, I would prefer to keep that untouched. So, um, so just to confirm we're not playing today, I suppose, in that case. Like, today, like, right now. Like, basically, I'll end the stream. Uh, okay, I have to get ready for lunch. We're meeting family. This day really sucks for last-minute plan making. It's okay, no worries. I mean, it's last-minute after all, so... Yeah, no worries about that. I mean, I'll be ending in another 10 minutes, so, um, yeah, it, it will, it actually, the reason for ending early is to allow minimal noise, um, to my family so that, you know, they can rest better, and, uh, um, that's why tomorrow's stream I try to not be, like, more, um, on, on Minecraft, because I really tend to react more strongly in Minecraft than other games, so, I mean, other streams. Uh, otherwise, I would be totally on board for it. Yeah, sleep. <laughs> sleep. Um, yeah, so tomorrow, um, if I do stream, I think it won't be Stardew Valley, it'll be StarCraft 2, and then you can decide if you want to join me uh, based on your um, um, different factors and considerations. Do let me know, because I'll have to add you onto my friends list before the stream begins. Maybe I can add you while on stream. That's fine. The friend list is just there. So, um, yeah. Uh, so, if you want to join, if you're able to join, 
um, just let me know on stream. And um, regardless, I think I'll, I'll stream Stardew Valley. I mean, no, Starcraft, not Stardew Valley, it's all stars. It's most, most, both of them are stars. I need to have, I need to make sure I still have it installed. Sure, sure. Do you want to check it right now? Because it's pretty large. The file is huge. Um, and no obligations at all. If you don't have, it's okay. You don't have to purposely install it right now. Because if anything, I would prefer you install it in your new PC. Because it's going to be better performance, definitely. It's going to be way better performance. Hey, we're reaching. Look at this. We need to take a little bend to that side, though. Definitely. We'll have to take a bend. I think we'll take the bend in the in the ocean yeah so um isim if you don't have it installed um it's okay don't trouble yourself to install it because you know like you're gonna change a new pc soon no point installing it right you're gonna get better performance in your new pc once it arrives hey jack welcome to the stream Hello, it's been a couple of days, I think. Welcome to the stream. Greetings to you. How have you been? Hi, hi. Greetings to you. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, we managed to dodge them all. We managed to dodge them all. Isn't that good? Isn't ain't that good? <laughs> ain't that good? Battle.net requires an update. I have gigabit internet. It wouldn't take long. Yeah, I mean, if it's just an update, I don't think it's going to take really long. Basically, um, the StarCraft update usually takes, including Battle.net, it usually takes like maybe two minutes. Yeah, thereabouts. If it hasn't been updated for a long while, I would, I would estimate maybe five to ten minutes. So, uh, Jack says, country roads take me home. Hey, that's a song. I love that song. And Glaze, welcome to the stream. Greetings to you. That's a very interesting name. And you have a sage in your name too. Welcome to the stream. Hello, greetings, greetings. Um, I'm just building underwater and uh, trying to remove kelp from below my structure so that it doesn't... Um, stretch into my structure yeah so basically I don't want um, the buildings going into my structure and therefore I'm just I mean the kelp going into my structure and uh, yeah <laughs> that's a reason why I'm destroying the kelp but welcome welcome to the stream can I make the stereotypical joke though? You said you were bad at StarCraft, but but you are an Asian. They're gods at StarCraft. Uh, <laughs> depends. Depends. Really depends. Like, um, not all Asians are good. I'm the exception, for example. I'm not good. Yeah, I'm, I'm not good. I'm one of the not good Asians at StarCraft. Really not good, seriously. <laughs> I'm not good at StarCraft. No. Um, I can play on like you know normal mode, and uh, like hard mode, but the reason why I play on brutal mode is just to accumulate EXP for um leveling up. Uh, the profile. Because like brutal mode, they give you more EXP. But generally, I'm not so good. Um, a sim, have you seen? Have you seen me play StarCraft on um on Twitch before? Have you seen me play StarCraft before? Because I've I've played StarCraft on Twitch before. This is not the first time I played. Yeah, like this is not my first rodeo. <laughs> That's what usually be, what people say, right? This is not the first rodeo. Oh, did I? Did my um potion run out again? I think it did. Um 
Listen, if I play with you, you will be telling yourself, geez, I'm the best. I haven't played multiplayer yet, I don't think. Oh, I see. I mean, like, really, though, um... I'm not good at it, honestly. Um, and, uh... Yeah, don't, don't you worry. Don't you worry. I'm not good at it, so... If you're bad, I'm also not far off. I'm also not good, so don't worry. We'll just lose the game together. It's just a game. Let's just lose the game together. No harm done. No harm done. Really. It's just a game. Meant to be lost. Who cares? Just lose the game together. That is if you really do play. Because like you know, like you said, you might have other commitments going on. So um we'll we'll keep that as an if. But if you do play, we'll just enjoy the game. Who cares? Who cares about winning? Winning is just a uh, is just an add-on to fun. Games and fun, that's the priority. Winning, that's an add-on. So, yeah, don't you worry about that. <laughs> Okay, we're two minutes off to um, to the time to end the stream, because 11.30, so free to play until level 5. Do you have to pay afterwards? Okay, okay, um, let me make my way back while I explain. So, um, Asymmetrical, did you buy the campaign or did you get the Free Wings of Liberty campaign? D did you buy the campaign? And which campaigns did you purchase if you did buy the campaigns? So that I can give you like a directed example. But don't worry, you don't have to... No, depends, really depends if, if you bought the game or uh, you got it for free. I believe even if you do, if you did get it for free though, you should be able to play without paying. Yeah, you should be able to play without paying, even after level 5. I believe so. Okay, we're just going to um, talk about like setting up StarCraft. I guess I don't have NCO. Uh, NCO, NCO is... Uh, what is NCO? Um, the one for... Uh, wait, NCO? NCO is... No, I know there's one campaign that is like the expansion set. Uh, it's uh, it's not really expansion. It's more of like um, for the ghost one. I can't remember. The Nova campaign. Yeah, Nova Covert Ops. Yes, Nova Covert, Covert Ops. That's what it is. You don't need Nova Covert Ops. You just get Nova for free. But if you have got Walls, um, HOTS, and uh, LOV like Legacy of the Void, what you get is like you get um uh Rainer, you get Kerrigan, Zagara, Swan, uh Vorazum, Carex. You get these commanders that you can freely play without paying. The other commanders you will have to pay after level five. So for these commanders that I've stated um, for example, like Rainer, Kerrigan, and all that, the one that I've just stated, what you have is that you can play from level 1 to level 15, and that's the maximum level of the commander. After that, it's your profile mastery level that applies throughout all commanders that are 15. 
that are level 15. So as long as you, your commander reaches level 15, it will take your mastery level of your profile, whatever the profile mastery level is. So let's say, for example, um, if you're playing Rainer, so your Rainer is at level 15, then you start to get EXP on your mastery, okay, the mastery level. So what happens is that, let's say your mastery level is at level, uh, up till level 90. Um, basically, beyond level 90, you don't get any more benefits. Like, mastery level up to level 90, you can assign skill points to, to spend them on something, on benefits and whatnot. Beyond level 90, however, um, they're just for show. They're just uh, bragging rights. So nothing of use beyond level 90. So suppose your Rainer is at level 15. That's a maximum for any commander. Then suppose your mastery level is at level 50. Let's say you want to play Kerrigan. You start at level 1. So when you play Rainer, you will play Mastery 50 Rainer. When you play Kerrigan, you play level 1 Kerrigan. Okay? You can play continuously level up. So let's say if you mastery if you level up your mastery level to level 53, your Rainer will be mastery level 53. But your Kerrigan will still be level 1. So let's say you train Kerrigan to level 15. As soon as Kerrigan reaches level 15, the next round you play Kerrigan, you are playing Mastery level 53 Kerrigan, just like how you would play Mastery level 53 Rainer. However, if your Zagara is level 1, it stays level 1. It won't take the Mastery level until you level that up to level 15. And then again, it will take your latest Mastery level that you've achieved on any other commanders. So that's what applies to um, the mastery levels. So with regards to payment, and hi Rin, welcome to the stream. I'm actually about to end. <laughs> I'm ending it early today. <laughs> yeah, because you know, like um, my parents need to um, have a better rest. So I'm trying to not like, you know, uh, be too noisy. So maybe like, um, are you, are any one of our friends streaming on Twitch? Maybe I'll go watch you guys play. Yeah, but um, I think I'll be I'll be ending early today. Uh, I see. Sorry, I was late. No, Rin, you're never late. Just like Asim always uh, says, you know, when 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 he's late for just no not late when he just arrives one to two minutes after the stream like uh, into the stream he'll say he's late but no you guys are never late no one's ever late just arrive precisely when you want to <laughs> a wizard pr arrives precisely when he means to or when she means to so don't worry no one's ever late no one's ever late don't worry about that So, um, yeah, anyway, um, I guess I'm just coming back here to store some of these things and I'll go back and end the stream there. But Rin, at the very least, I can show you what's the progress I've made in terms of the tunnel. Because like, you know, um, tonight, uh, we're just going to build the tunnel. So like, you know, um, yeah, it's, it's pretty much just tunneling. So I can show you um, the tunnel, like what's the progress on the tunnel. And then tomorrow, I'll be streaming on Twitch, uh, but it won't be Stardew Valley. I'll probably be streaming um, StarCraft 2, and if possible, if possible, a sim will be joining me on a co-op. So we'll be playing co-op mode. That's why I was explaining to a sim the co-op mode. So if if it's possible, a sim will join me on co-op mode on starcraft 2 so rin if you're free to drop by on twitch tomorrow you'll be able to see us play co-op mode on starcraft 2 and let me tell you asim's gonna kill it asim's awesome at rts games so yeah 
I sent you the email address associated with my BattleNet account on Discord. Okay, no problem. But I don't think you add me through email account, though. I think you add me through, um, just like basically, um, if not, I want to watch Rin, but Soul said no. Rin, you don't play RTS. You told me before you, the only genre that you avoid is RTS, right? Build time strategy. Like, build a base, build an, uh, armies, and send them out to fight. That's the only genre that you just simply avoid because you don't like the genre. Like, you you don't mind watching it, but just that you don't play it, right? That's why I was saying, no, Rin doesn't play RTS games. Because I kind of remember you mentioned that you just don't play RTS. Like, turn play, turn base, RTS, not really. Um, yeah... Oh, add with tag or email. Okay, no problem. I'm gonna add you right after this, right after the stream. Uh, let me see if there's more iron before we go back and show Rin the progress. Any more iron? Oh, three only, not good. Looks like I'll have to hang out here more often to repair my tools and whatnot and then to accumulate more iron. I'm too brain dead for RTS. <laughs> well, well, well. Um, Asim, Asim. If anything, Rin, are you free to stream tomorrow morning? Are you free to co-op tomorrow morning? Instead of watching me play Stardew Valley, because the reason why I don't want to play Stardew Valley is that you know I'm gonna have another vod to edit, and I'm currently channeling my attention to um the new series that i'm bringing to the channel so i don't want to have backlog votes for a very long time that's pending over there so with no progress on um stardew valley i'll not be pressurized with votes to edit and then um, i can focus on the new series so yeah but rin if you're free to stream tomorrow or just play tomorrow morning because like there is a possibility that Asim cannot play Star uh, StarCraft, so yeah, it's okay. Um, Rit says I don't know if I can wake up on time for the stream. It's fine if you're not here. I'll just proceed with StarCraft. But if you are able to wake up, Asim, let's say if you are not able to join us on like join join me on StarCraft, and if Rin is able to make it tomorrow, we're going to collab, Overcooked too. Do you still have Overcooked 2, Rin? We just have some light fun, basically. Like, you know, I don't think Raft will be a good uh, thing to play in the morning. Like, you know, it's more for a night stream rather than a day stream kind of thing. So, um, if you want to play Raft, I can play too. Just I was thinking, why don't we just play something light, like, you know, Overcooked 2? Because you had Overcooked 2, I know we played it before. So we can play Overcooked 2, and then, um, yeah, if you are able to make it on for the stream, you, we can play Overcooked 2, and if Asim is able to join us later, then we have a 3-player Overcooked 2, if Asim has Overcooked 2. So, that can work too, but if Asim is able to play, then we'll be streaming a few rounds of StarCraft first. And if, uh, like, you know, we still have time, we can switch over to Overcooked 2. And then there'll be three players on Overcooked 2. Yeah. Um, Rin says, oh, OC2 sounds fun. I don't mind playing OC2. Yeah, exactly. And um, um, Asim says, thing is, when I play RTS, I learn from trial and error. I know a lot of people who like to learn the strats, but I guess I can learn that way. Um, Yeah, I mean, I, I learned through trial and error i don't really go search for strategy like you know they, they say something like what 14 pool for a zerg that means like at 14 population your 14 units you start building another structure called the spawning pool um like you know timing based building 10 pool 14 pool uh um like um um like timing push or something like once you upgrade something you push towards the enemy and things like that uh these kind of things no not my type either i just learned through trial and error so it's the same it's the same so a sim if you can make it and if you've got nothing on um we'll we'll prioritize starcraft too so rin if you're able to make it later um then we can switch over to oc2 but the priority will still be StarCraft 2 because that's the existing plan at the moment. 
So we'll stick with that. We'll stick with StarCraft 2 first, and then eventually we'll move on to OC2 later, if, if anything. So we'll see how StarCraft 2 goes first. And um, Rin, so this is our progress right now. Okay, like I'm, I'm building a little bit further out. You can see these uh, uh, path. Okay, it's not covered yet. Okay, we uh, basically stretched all the way to here. And if I go to the surface and I look around, does this look familiar? Does that look familiar to you? We are at our destination. Finally, it's in sight. We can see where we're heading to now. Yeah. This is our progress. This island is where we want to go. So we are finally here. Just that, you know, it's only halfway done and I think I'll run out of diorite. So I may have to go mining for some diorite or something. But um, yeah, that's good progress. Yeah, exactly. I think it's pretty cool. So um, I'm gonna be able to just uh, turn inwards and uh, do something about it. Yeah. But basically today I'd spend a lot of time digging through the island. So um, unfortunately it's, it's uh, yeah, it took me quite a long time because like, you know, we're, we're not just building, we're also excavating at the same time. Wash paws, wash your paws. And if you don't wash, you have worms. What do you mean, uh, kitty? Is that like a, a song or something? Is that like a song? Yeah, so, okay, so basically, um, Rin, this is what I dug through, this island, basically. This one, you can see from here, and then here. So this was the island that I dug through. Yeah, looks very familiar. It definitely looks like square cubes out in the distance, laid out in a way that looks like a geographic location. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. It's 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 a uh, cubes and uh, and uh, squares and. Uh, different textures and different colors, you know, some beige color that looks a bit like a um, sand, you know, sand, 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 and some green, some green that doesn't look very green, looks like a dull green, you know, reminds you of a, um, an arid a savanna, a biome, you know, that kind of thing, where um, there is no water and there is no plant life, it's devoid of life. Yeah, yeah, that's that's what that is, you know. You see that? Yeah, cubes, <laughs> cubes. Uh, anyway, let's just do a quick check. Yeah, we have one. We have one malignant uh kelp plant down here. Malignant ones. The rest are fine, I suppose. The rest are fine. It's just that one malignant one. Uh, one. Yeah, the rest are okay. We're just building through kelp forests. So, anyways, um, um, I am looking forward to spring sale for Steam, because I want to get House Flipper, and I'm gonna put it as a raw let's play. So that's my intention: a raw let's play for House Flipper. Oh, okay, before I end the stream, there's one more thing. I need to go get two signposts. I know I left them somewhere, but I forgot where I left them. I know I need them. Do I have them here? No, I left them somewhere inside. So we're going to get them before I end the stream because I'm going to forget. I'm definitely going to forget. So, yeah, let's let's go. Let's go get the, uh, let's go get the um, signposts first. So basically tomorrow morning, um, the plan is that I will try to start stream earlier, um, like maybe 9.30 instead of the usual 10 on a Sunday, because like I sleep in late, but I think I want to start at like 9.30. Um, if I can wake up on time, maybe even 9 o'clock, um, and then I'll just set up uh, StarCraft 2 and uh, I'll be on Twitch. So, yeah, we're going to play 
a few rounds of StarCraft 2 and when Rin drops by, we can switch over to OC2 if necessary. I've got OC2 installed, it's still installed. So I'm fine with switching over to OC2 if ASIM is okay. ASIM, do you have OC2? Do you have o Overcooked 2? If you have Overcooked 2, uh, we can have a 3 player Overcooked game. Of course, I'll be very bad at it given that, you know, I'm not playing on the controller. So I only have like, you know, the, um, 8 directions of movement, basically W A D W A S D and then W A W D and S A S D key. So um yeah. So basically I only have 8 directions. Oh, okay, okay. No need. It's here. So let's see. It's all here. So we can just take it and then go back. Uh, nope, I can look into it. No, 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 it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. I mean, like, if you don't have it, you don't have to, like, intentionally purchase it. So, it's fine. No worries, no worries. Um, then, then tomorrow, you'll be able to see me and Rin play also, like, after our StarCraft stream. Um, or, if you're not able to play StarCraft, then we'll go straight into, um, Overcook. I mean, when Rin arrives, that is. Uh, yeah, and then I'll just play a couple of games for, uh, I might not purchase it, I've never heard of it. Um, it's kid-friendly, at least, we'll say that much. It's kid-friendly, um, you can take a look at how the game plays, and then you can decide if that will be a future purchase. It's pretty good, I have it on, um, I have it on my Nintendo Switch, but I bought it again on Steam, um, some time ago. Yeah, some time ago. So, it's a pretty good game. So maybe, maybe whether whether you join or not for StarCraft Two, I think we can still play a little bit of OC Two just to show you how the game works. So whenever Rin drops by, um, like towards the end of the stream or something, we can always switch over to OC Two for like a, a few missions. Maybe like each mission is gonna be like just like three minutes or so, and. Uh, I think three minutes or or up to five minutes so we can play like half an hour worth of game and that'll be that'll be almost like what five to ten missions i think depending on our speed so it's pretty cool yeah and rin did confirm that she's up for it um as long as um like the waking time is fine so yeah okay so we're back here I don't think I want to log out here, so once again, we'll have to go back. <laughs> We're going back and forth, I know. I'm just bringing in the uh, signpost and um, putting it there before we head back. So I'll be ending the stream once we go to the base and we'll log out there. Alright, okay, so so um, ending early is also to facilitate me being able to wake up for tomorrow's stream too. And also, um, I think my parents are sleeping, so it'd be good if I don't uh, talk too loud now. So, um, yeah, I think that's it for now. Uh, so, Asim, um, maybe you can take a look at the OC2. I'll add you right after the stream for StarCraft 2. Um, I'll just add you into my... Um, like my friends list um, and then tomorrow we'll see what happens like if you if you're not keen to uh, or you have commitments and you're not able to play I'll still play StarCraft 2 like I said yeah I've been repeating this many times because I'm running out of things to say already <laughs> so anyways I'm um, um, just want to say thank you to Asim and Rin for um, dropping by. Thank you so much for helping me and thank you for your support. Um, I want to thank Kitty uh, for, for your comments and for sharing different memes and all that. Um, I'm gonna thank Dallas uh, and, and also for the jokes that I think Dallas said some jokes though just now. So Dallas, um, Jack, thank you. Um, uh, Minecraft Fools. Minecraft Fools still hasn't mentioned where he's from, or where she's from. Um, Glaze, welcome. 
and uh, thank you for dropping by. Um, 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 Andri, Andri Gaming from um, Indonesia. Um, Kitty, thank you once again. Kitty is like drop um, on and off, on and off. So <laughs> thank you for still staying around. Thank you, thank you. And thanks for sharing once again. I think Kitty shared a lot of memes and all that. Um, yeah. Um, Rin says, hope you have a great night. Thank you, Rin. Thank you for dropping by. I'm so sorry I'm ending the stream early. So I hope you can wake up early. We can do um, OC2 after the StarCraft stream or stream a little bit at least, depending on whether ASIM can join or not. The, the length in the duration might lengthen just a bit more um yeah um okay so we have um said bed doggy said uh thank you um eagle who came by offering some suggestions i believe eagle came by before offering similar suggestions so i mean like that's why i was like hmm i think eagle came by before i remember these sentences Anyways, um, thank you, thank you for dropping by, Dallas. I've um, thanked you, but thank you again, Yoda. Still, still on that um topic. So, anyways, thank you, thanks for dropping by, Roger. Sit, thank you. Um, who else? I think that's all. So, Asim and Rin, thank you once again for the support. I hope to collab with you all tomorrow morning, um, which is tonight for Asim. Um. And that's it. So, uh, yeah. So, StarCraft 2 and possibly OC2. Overcooked 2. On Twitch tomorrow. I'll update the Twitter. I haven't updated it yet. So, yeah. That's it. So, thanks again. Um, have a good morning, afternoon, evening, night. And um, Rin, good night. Have a good sleep. Asim, have a good sat Saturday. No, actually, Saturday? Hang on, Saturday, right? Yeah, Saturday. Have a good Saturday. So, I'll see you all next stream. Good night, goodbye, good day. That's all I have for now. Have a nice day. Bye-bye. And Asim says, have a great night. You too. Bye-bye.